Hey guys, today I wanted to show you how to make a garden box that is practical, looks good, and is easy to make with a few simple tools. I'm using Western Red Cedar, and uh, my dimensions are approximately seven feet by about three feet. You can change that depending on uh, your needs. I'm gonna start off by just uh, cutting the lumber to length, uh, seven feet long, and then I'm doing 33 inches wide. So you can kind of see this is how it all frames out. So the next step, I have these uh, two by two furring and something I thought of the last time I did this, I'm gonna make them about two inches longer than the height of the box and uh, put some spikes on them so that they'll, I'll be able to drive it into the ground and uh, I'll kind of hold it in place. I have just the right amount of garbage over there to have the proper height. Not really crucial that they're all exact or perfect. So um, nice thing about this table is I know it is completely flat. So what I'm gonna do is actually start screwing this all together into these pieces. And this will actually be the bottom of the garden box. This might be one of those parts where like you can get the first one or one of them in its entirety and then just like You can delete that. It's a box. It's like a ninja warrior course in here right now. Well, it's not for me. I'm just putting some glue on here, and then I'm gonna use this brad nailer just to hold them in place. You don't even have to put these end caps on. Uh, I just think it looks a lot nicer, and it'll also, most of the moisture gain and loss happens through the end grains. So we're gonna put tr uh, trim across the top of this too, so I'm just making sure that this isn't uh, sticking out past the top because we want this whole surface to be flat. The last step, well, almost last step, is to just put some trim around uh, the top. It just makes it look nice. I'm just gonna cut the miter on it and then just draw the line so that I don't have to measure it. This is so sketchy. All right. This way I don't have to measure anything. I'm just gonna make a mark right here. And I have to cut this about a 45 right there. I'm okay with that. One thing I have done on the other ones is put this landscaping fabric on the inside that's supposed to just uh, kind of keep things in and keep things out that shouldn't be in. <laughs> 